the Lee Oscar harmonica system provides you with replaceable and interchangeable reed plates available in every key. The only tool you need is a Phillips number one screwdriver with a large enough handle. Follow these tips to identify and install your reed plates correctly. To disassemble your reed plates, simply remove the three screws from the top reed plate. Remember, to avoid damaging reeds, always handle the reed plates by their edges. To reassemble, orient the comb with the mouthpiece facing towards you and the longer chambers on the left. The top reed plate has the three larger through holes and is installed with the reeds face down towards the comb, longer reeds on the left, and the free ends pointing away from you. The bottom reed plate has three smaller holes and is installed with the reeds on the outside facing away from the comb and the free ends pointing towards you. Drop the three screws into the through holes of the top reed plate. Remember that these screws are self-tapping. When installing new reed plates, it's normal to hear a squeaking sound as you bore through the holes in the bottom reed plate. When tightening down the reed plates, be sure to apply enough torque and pressure to keep the heads from stripping. You must tighten the screws all the way down to ensure air tightness. With a proper fit, the screws should be completely through the bottom reed plate. Let's take a closer look at the top reed plate when fit properly. Facing the mouthpiece, the longer reeds are on the left, and the reeds sit inside the comb, with the free ends pointing away. The quality control code is on the right, with the last letter indicating the key. Turned over to see the bottom plate, you'll notice once again the longer reeds are on the left. In this case, the reeds are sitting on the outside of the comb and should point towards you when holding the harmonica in normal playing position. There again is our quality control code visible on the outside.